Hi workers, this is Anna from Tulme Tarot and today I'll be doing your monthly reading for the month of May 2019 in love. Um, please keep in mind this is a journal reading. It may or may not resonate with you. If it resonates with you, good. Uh, if it does not resonate with you, let it go. Check out some amazing tarot card readers on YouTube which resonates with you. I'm open for tips and donations. Please be generous and um, the link is in the description box below. Um, you can email me and I'll send you my personal information where you can donate to the channel so that I can give full time and attention to this channel and help you out more. Um, if you want to book a personal reading with me, feel free to drop an email and I'll send you my calendar which is uh, swamped right now but I will definitely try to accommodate you um, as per your schedule. It's open, um, there are a few slots available in it so check, it th check them out and um, let's get into your reading. Work is for the month of May, April 2019 and now. Work is for the month. I don't know what's wrong with me. Uh, with April, I was saying 2014 all the time. With May, I'm saying 2015. This is not... Oh. The bitch is there. Sorry. Sorry for it as well. The Queen of Swords in reverse. Page of Swords. Four of Wands. I think I'm gonna move the camera back so you can I can have space. Knight of Wands Temperance Wheel of Fortune All right, um, before I complete this thread, uh, I'll tell you what I, three of, uh, three of wands in a verse, what I had in your pre-shuffle. Um, during your pre-shuffle, I, uh, I was uh, hearing a lot of uh, time, 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 time. And then uh, all of a sudden a visual came into my head which was about um, two bright lights shining high so uh, you might be feeling some sort of delays in your love life uh, but um, keep in mind that uh, Knight of Pentacles Keep in mind that um, the delays uh, came with uh, a lot of uh, hope and divine kind of energy uh, and uh, because I saw two lights so that means um, it might be um, lover's card <laughs> sorry it it might be <laughs> it made perfectly sense with that card yeah it might be divine love um bottom of the deck is page of wands in reverse good for you you're not taking offers from young lovers young but passionate but not stable 
anyways um in past you might be dealing with someone who was a little like i said before um total bitch um i i swear on the channel so um if you if you mind that i'm really sorry about it in advance um she was emotionally scarred um she didn't want to offer her love um but due to some reason you guys were still communicating with each other no offers of love but you were you might be in the friend zone yeah because you were communicating and the communication was good if the communication was good you were in the on the same level of thinking you were vibing because that was making you really happy honestly speaking despite the fact that they were emotionally closed and they were not willing to offer you any love um they were friends with you probably uh, you know a friend um who you can have um, a very good kind of communication um and then you fall for them uh, but they are emotionally closed so but mm, nevertheless you were happy you were happy being friends with them and um in may i see you getting an offer from a mature person someone older than you someone uh, older and has a lot of fire energy or fire in their chart uh somebody is a fire sign uh could be fire sign yeah could be a fire sign um he will be older than you but he is full of life and uh he or she um they're very jolly they they will make your they'll make your life um you know um some people just make you laugh um in difficult situations so this is that kind of personality which is coming to reverence you with an offer um yeah and this will create um a balance in your life like you were dealing with an emotionally scarred person uh which definitely was making you happy but at the same time draining you emotionally um these what we these are the kind of people we call emotional vampires who feed on your energy and um so your life was out, out of balance and nature gave you a balanced relationship a balanced offer nature is giving you a balanced offer because the universe is in your favor universe want to help you universe want to you know uh, that delay which you were facing they want to end that delay yeah they want to end that delay now time will move on quickly in the month of may things will move fast for you wheel of fortune is no page of swords or ace of swords but it still means to me that it seems to me that things will speed up they were fast with the other person but uh, not in terms of love but only communication there was no growth uh in terms of love there was only growth in terms of communication and friendship not um, other kind of love offers or anything but this king of wands is offering you his love um and um it, it will uh, it will happen in the month of may you'll get an offer but i see you waiting for someone I see you waiting for someone to come in. You're not interested in the king. Despite the fact that the king will bring in a lot of um hope and balance in your life, uh, a balance between emotions, mm, give you emotional strength. Water and fire combined. But you are waiting on someone else. you're waiting for something better than a king 
and again universe gave you the king of pentacles although this is this is like the opposite of king of wands this is a very materialistic um financially stable um more focused on the career um kind of person he um he works hard um he holds a lot of authority uh, could be in a, a person who owns his own business um yeah he's definitely he definitely owns his uh, owns a business or uh, on a very high level of authority um his position is um very strong in the community and that person is your divine love so you might be getting two offers but one of them is your divine love partner one of them will make your world rock one will create balance in your life but you will you're not accepting it you're walking away from it not walking away but it this is not six of swords um but three of wands in reverse also means you're you're impatient you're stagnant you're like no you're not looking forward you're just stuck you're like let's see what happens so the the forward movement will be probably be with this king of pentacles watch out for someone who's who's an authority figure in an organization who's good with numbers probably in fields of finance working in the fields of finance um uh, who's the ceo of his business who owns a business uh, basically and ceo of the company um who's authoritative in nature is um who's a little stubborn and stern as well who's very possessive about his materialistic wealth but this person is is your divine love this is the divine love i was talking about in about the precept when the card appeared that is one sign that this king is your divine love but it's a tricky situation because you have to choose sorry you have to choose between these two kings this this could be your divine love this could also be but you'll have to identify who's who let's get some clarifiers what is this queen of swords ring here knight of cups in reverse and 10 of wands yeah what did i tell you let me just i <laughs> I told you she was emotionally closed. She was communicating with you, but as a friend. And then we clarified it with Knights of Cup in reverse and Ten of Wands. She might be communicating with you, but that was becoming troublesome with you, troublesome for you, because you she was not offering love. You you wanted love. You wanted love. I cannot see how I cannot move for this. You were looking for love and she wasn't willing to give you love. She wasn't offering her love to you. No. Just friendship, friend zone. Nothing else. <sighs> 
What is this Four of Wands doing here? Let's feel it. Four of Pentacles in the reverse. You were just happy that you were not stuck in a situation and you were you were just just happy in the moment you were not holding on to anything what is this king of wands doing here what is this king of wands doing here queen of pentacles in reverse Ooh. definitely not a soulmate definitely not a soulmate this king will be too harsh for you to handle some people are jolly in nature sorry this is universe some people are jolly in nature but they're not they're toxic in relationships they're toxic in love they they want to own you and you don't want that definitely don't want that yeah ten of cups he will make you happy he will make you feel happy definitely but he will be not financially as strong as this king of pentacles so yeah the jolly nature will be helpful what is this three of wands in reverse there for hire a friend that's like a wonderful career you were stuck in universe gave you forward moment universe pushed you universe pushed you you were stuck in the situation probably stuck with this king who was making you feel happy but now i get it so you meet this king first you were in relationship uh, friend zone with this queen of swords in reverse uh, who was not willing to offer her love to you but it was making you feel happy because you were like it's going in a flow um but then you met this then you meet this um king of wands who because of his jolly nature is making you feel happy but he's not the ideal kind of personality which you might be looking for some people are um, good as friends some people are good as lovers and again you came to that nature where you were like things are going good things are okay he's making me laugh at least uh, he's not like the queen of swords who was making me miserable miserable by not offering love so here you have temperance that means the balance was created in your life and you enjoyed that balance you enjoyed that balance what is this and but at the same time you were stuck you didn't want to move forward because when you're not in love and you're just wasting your time and wasting other person's life you're stuck you're not making space for the next love to come you were stuck and universe gave you a sign to move forward because this king was waiting for you this king of pentacles what is this wheel of fortune here for Nineteen minutes in and Ace of Cups. Okay. So the universe is working to bring you the love of your life, which is I'm loving this 
pentacles. Usually I hate him. <sighs> what is this king of pentacles doing here? What is this king of pentacles doing here? This king of pentacles. Oh my god. Those were too, too many cards flipped over. Gona, that's up. Pentacles here for Eight of Cups in reverse. You were stuck before with the King of Pentacles. You're not walking away. You're walking towards your cups. You're walking away towards love. Oh you're walking towards love, sorry. And you have the moon, blessed moon. And see, this is <clears throat> okay. Now I have two feelings. This King of Pentacles could be someone you know from your past, or it could also mean that just union. A happy union. Alright guys, let's get an oracle card for you and <sighs> the ocean. The deep blue sea speaks to your soul, healing and soothing you. Even the act of imagining yourself dipping into its healing womb brings about desirable effects. Better yet, spend some time physically near the ocean. Allow its power and beauty to wash away all your cares and concerns. That's all you need in life. By the way, I could see a lot of water in this chart. I can actually see all of signs here, but um, Gemini here, Libra here, but a lot of water, a lot of water. So you might be dealing with an, uh, with a water sign, but this King of Pentacles is uh, definitely an earth sign. Anyways, I hope you have a nice month of May because your reading is wonderful you just need to heal yourself and make wise choices you have offers and offer both offers are good but you have to choose wisely have a nice month bye